Dictate their offense with this super easy blitz scheme. Coming up next. This is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that gives you full games of all the tips and schemes I post my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. So guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe button, also that notification icon so you can never miss an upload. So I uh, went into the lab. I'm looking at the 43 defense. There's a lot of great formations in here that I'm going to start using online uh, just to kind of confuse my opponent, uh, in particular the wide nine, the normal, uh, the under, and the over. And I went into the lab and took a look at the over and it's got one of the easiest blitz setups in the game. You get pressure off the edge, off the left tackle, or if you flip the play off the right tackle. Uh, very easy setup, basically three steps, and it's going to help you go ahead and get easy pressure, force him to block his running back, force him to go ahead and slide protect, and it's going to put you in a situation where you can start winning uh, defensively and start dictating how he runs his offense. So it's a good pocket blitz, as I've stated before, guys, to have in your back pocket when you need to have pressure against your, against your opponent, and you can leverage your entire coverage around that. So uh, we're going to take a look at two different types of shells. Uh, we can take a look at the Wheel Blitz 3 Press and also is going to be the Fire Zone 2. Now I'm going to go against random uh, shotgun plays, so I don't necessarily going to know what the computer is going to do. So we're going to go from that. And I'm going to show you my controller too while we're at it. All right, so to set the splits up, you're going to base a line. You're going to take your defensive line and slide them off to the left. So you're going to hit your, your left D-pad and slide them off to the left. Uh, and then you're going to go ahead and crash down by hitting your left D-pad and then slanting inside. Uh, and uh, you can QB contain, um, but the, the key to this figure blitz is what you're going to do is you're going to hover over this guard right here. Um, and then uh, basically try to preoccupy that, that right guard. Uh, and the pressure should come off the left side of the edge. So you can see right here, the pressure comes screaming off the edge uh, and the way this alignment sets up, it works very well. So if you can see right here, the pressure is going to come off this guy right here. Uh, this is where the pressure is going to come off and you can, uh, the way this blitz sets up, we're going to preoccupy, preoccupy this guard right here uh, and then peel away and go into coverage and the pressure is going to come screaming off the edge. So if you've got a fast linebacker, 90, a 93 plus linebacker, he's going to come off the edge and get easy, easy pressure off the edge against your, uh, against your opponent. So you can see uh, the pressure is very easy to set up. And what's cool about it is you can go ahead and cross man that middle linebacker just to give yourself another type of a coverage look against your opponent. Uh, and that just gives you just another area of the field that you can look to. So you can see that defender actually comes in the area and makes a play. Now what's great about this particular play is that you have the wheel blitz three press, which essentially is a cover three version of it. So once again, the same kind of setup, but now you've got guys going to flat seams, going across the middle. You've got that cover three look. Line, shift the line down, crash down. And we're gonna go ahead and do hard flats right here just to go ahead and give our opponent a takeaway flat reads. We're just going to go ahead and just get the pressure off the edge. So this is what I do like about this blitz. It is a very easy blitz to set up. Uh, the difference now is you're going to crash down and QB contain, but you're always going to get that pressure off the edge. He's going to have to shade his protection. He's also going to have to go ahead and probably block six to go ahead and take away that edge pressure. And the way I'm going to have this set up on my Patreon channels, I'm actually going to have a full defensive scheme that you can throw into this where you can you can catch your opponent if he starts rolling off to the right because what happens with this particular blitz they always roll off to the right. So once again, my subscribers, thanks for support. If you do like these tips, make sure you hit the the, um, the like button. And I'll be rolling out more Madden gameplay and tips coming up soon. So once again, thank you for your support. And until next time.